lot of couples here tonight. It's nice. I'm real happy for you. <laughs> I'm not married. I'm 34. I'm not married. I give up. <laughs> really, I was just at my cousin's wedding. I caught the bouquet. I just took it home and repotted it. <laughs> It's not old, is it? No. Nah. Uh, it's not. No, sometimes I find myself thinking and saying these really old things like, you call that music? <laughs> what are they saying? I don't understand the words. <laughs> Get a haircut. <laughs> and the outfits I wear, you know, I can't, the other night I went out with a friend that was wearing a sweatshirt and sweatpants, no big deal. But I looked down at myself, I said, gee, Sometimes I wear the same thing to bed. <laughs> that line of demarcation is getting really fuzzy. I have a feeling one day I'm gonna be standing in my living room wearing my pajamas thinking, gee, uh, should I go to sleep or go out dancing with my friends? <laughs> and my dad, my dad's gonna be 71. He's getting up there. He's very handsome, but his eyebrows are going crazy. <laughs> What is it with guys when they get old and their eyebrows? He looks like a mad scientist. <laughs> really, he goes to sleep and goes, ooh, dad, ooh, uh, did you take a nap or did you invent something? <laughs> he's, he's a CPA. And like every CPA I know, he's the most fastidious, meticulous, anal retentive person. <laughs> He is so impatient. You know, my father's the kind of guy who stands in front of a microwave and goes, come on! It's been 10 seconds. I don't have all minute. Really, if you ever meet my dad and you want to torture him, and you will, this is what you do. You tie him against the wall like this, with his arms and his legs like this, make him stare straight ahead. And then right in front of him, you refold a road map incorrectly. <laughs> Just twitches a little bit, then he passes ass. And my mom, you know, I was driving with my mom the other day. My mother is one of these really cautious drivers, a little bit too cautious. You know, she's driving along a road and there's a sign that says the road curves to the left. She signals that way. <laughs> just to let us know she's going there and not into that brick wall ahead of us. And my grandmother's 90. 90. Can you imagine being 90? Wow. What do you buy for a woman who's 90? Something she can use immediately. <laughs> and here she goes, open up. Oh, you missed it. Oh. She really is 90. She, she's dating. She's dating guys 93. It's going great. They never argue. They can't hear each other. 